Welcome back to Textonation. We are taking you to CES and a company called Articula, D-A-R-T-I-C-U-L-A, the company that brought back the Rubik's Cube with GoCube, and they're at it again with something called Go Chess. With us from Particula is CEO Udi Dor. Hi, Udi. Hey, hey, Fred. How are you? Terrific. And you're talking to us from the show floor. Let's start out with a little bit of background about your company. Sure. So uh, we are a Philippine based company uh, and we are reviving the classics. So, as you said, we take the uh, you know, classic. Uh, Evergreen favorite plastics and just bring life into them with uh, cool tech, new design, and providing a whole new uh, um, play experience, which uh, kind of using the uh, bridging the, the physical world and the digital world. So we started with the GoCube that was launched in Kickstarter and raised over one million dollar and uh, won lots of words. Uh, there were seventy of products in that cross line of smart cubes, and then we uh, uh, launched another Kickstarter, which is the Go Dice. Actually, it's a, a digital dice or physical dice, uh, which takes all the dice games, dice board games, board games, and uh, and connect them and provide again over here uh, the physical, the physical experience. Terrific. As said, right now we are launching, uh, announcing here right now the new product, which, which, uh, which is a uh, Go Chess, uh, which is a uh, uh, robotic uh, board game console. If you saw the chess. So this is a robotic chess game. Tell us about it. To step us through, and you can show it to us a little bit, but step us through how it's used. Uh, so what you see here is, uh, is a full-size robotic chessboard. Uh, very nice premium design. We build some outside where the pieces can move simultaneously. Uh, multiple pieces can move simultaneously. It's fully robotic, and the idea is that you know you can play chess with a remote player. Well, uh, any moves you make remotely is mirrored onto your local board. Uh, you can connect to the uh, uh, most popular chess platforms, such as uh, Liches, using your account and play with a friend. The other one on the other side can be can either uh, play with his uh, mobile phone or desktop, or you can use a such board. When you guys finish the game, the board will set up automatically for a new game for you. If you want to practice, you, want to practice, uh, you can choose levels according to uh, puzzles, according to you, your level, and the board will just set up those puzzles for you. Uh, and that's only part, one set of, uh, one, one part of the uh, chessboard. I want to show the other, the other side, which is this interactive, It's actually play. So what you can see here, this is the top panel of uh, of the robotic chess board I showed before. So as soon as I pick it, this the board just tell me uh, what what are the legit moves I can make with it, and I can also ask him for uh, to get some tips. For example, so right now we're just doing the same with uh, with the black piece. <clears throat> I hope you can see it clearly. It's very it's very noisy over here. So as soon as I pick a piece, I can see all the moves and I have color coding uh, for which is uh, uh, like scoring how, how good move I'm gonna make. Of course, you can enable or disable all those features if you wanna play without any tips, but this kind of can, you know, can improve your game and provide you kind of a self uh, personal culture, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So you can play, uh, uh, online with uh, someone at your level, invite a friend, or random play. Uh, you can play versus AI or a local game, one versus uh, yeah, another. Again, while the other side can be can move like that, or can be robotic, as uh, as seen before. That's very cool, Udi. So tell me, do do both players need to have uh, the the Go Chess? No. So. Um, so the other player can play through his uh, mobile phone. He can use, uh, you know, uh, just, uh, use his desktop. And and with our system, you can just invite a friend, uh, even if he doesn't have an account, you just play with him. That's very exciting. When will it be available and for about how much? We are going to reveal right now, we are just announcing it and showcasing you know, the technology and the product. 
we are going to launch it you know, on a Kickstarter in uh, April this year. Uh, over there, we'll be able to reveal all the information and all the prices and, uh, and the different variations of the wood, etc. So in April, you'll reveal the price on, on Kickstarter. When do you expect to be shipping? Probably the first, very, the first thing, the first uh, product will be shipped uh, by the end of this year. Very exciting. For more information, where can people go? Right. So uh, you can go to getgocube.com. Uh, and over there, there's, uh, you see the GoCube, Go Dice, and there's a specific web page for Go Chess. You can uh, subscribe over there. and will be notified as soon as we go live. Terrific. And once again, that website is getgocube.com. Udi Dor, thanks for joining us. So we know we know it's a, a lot of mayhem there at CES. We appreciate you taking the time. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you, Fred.